Sushmita was walking fast. She had to reach school by 10 a.m. to be on time for the dress rehearsal for the school's annual day function. It was already past 9.30 a.m. Suddenly, the strap of one of her sandals broke. She had to slow down. She couldn't walk fast. As she turned the corner, she saw a cobbler. Sushmita requested the cobbler to repair her shoes quickly. Sushmita paid him, thanked him and rushed for her dress rehearsal. Later in the night, Sushmita told her mother about the incident and said, I take that road every day to go to school, but I don't remember seeing him. He must have been there every day. You just didn't bother to look. Today, you needed him. So, you looked for him and you found him. In the developed nations like USA, you won't find any roadside cobbler. You only see them in India and maybe a few other Asian countries. After the incident of the cobbler, Sushmita started noticing the people in her locality whose services the family used, like the sweeper who sweeps the street every morning, the tailor, the school bus driver, the owner of the cycle repair shop, the carpenter, and the plumber. Let's try to know a little more about these people. Sushmita's mother gives hers and Sushmita's dresses to Arjun Master, the tailor. Arjun Master not only stitches well, but he also delivers on time. When Sushmita went to pick up her dress from Arjun Master, she looked around the tailor's shop. She saw that the tailor uses a sewing machine, threads, needles, scissors, chalk, pins, measuring tape, etc. For making clothes. Sushmita's school bus driver, Chandram, is a very careful driver. He never drives fast. Sushmita found out that Chandram's father is also a bus driver who drives public buses. Chandram's father taught him how to drive and how to change a tyre. He also learnt the importance of keeping his bus clean and spotless from his father. Sushmita's father called Hanif Ali the carpenter as he wanted to put up a few extra shelves in the drawing room. Hanif Ali's whole family is engaged in making furniture. A carpenter uses a hand drill machine, a saw, a screwdriver, an iron jack, a measuring tape, and of course, nails. One day, Sushmita went to Sabira aunt's house to check if she had completed embroidering her mother's sari. Embroidery had been Sabira aunt's hobby. She made a hobby her profession. She uses circular wooden frames of different sizes, colored threads and needles. Sushmita's brother Subir gets his bicycle repaired from Robert. He is a bicycle repairer. 
he uses cycle pumps, screwdrivers, spanners and old cycle tyres. Potters are not commonly seen in towns and cities, but in villages, pottery is quite a common profession. All the potter needs is a wheel, some clay and his skillful hands. The way his fingers shape the clay is magical. These people are so skillful, so patient and always there when we need them. They have turned their skills or hobbies into their profession. These humble people who give such good service to us are usually ignored by us. There are many more such people who help us in our daily life. We should appreciate all of them and thank them for their service.